everyone, Stick here from Maplewood Studio. How are you all doing? So today's video is all about comparing the RME Babyface against the Apogee Duet audio quality wise. And I'm expecting the, the audio capture to be very, very similar on both devices, if not identical. Um, and what I'm gonna do afterwards is I'm gonna listen back and play back the recordings from each device over the competitor's device. So I'll listen to the Apogee recordings via the RME and the RME recordings via the Apogee. And um, yeah, get, bear in mind they've both got the same chipset in the preamps. I'm expecting the capture to be very, very similar. Um, what is interesting is the Apogee Duet has that extra 10 dB headroom. So I'm not expecting to hear any additional noise, but I'm running both sets of preamps on both devices at 35 decibels. So, um, Yes, that's the most fair thing I think I can do instead of trying to get meters at the, you know, juggling meters and stuff. I think 35 dB, and I'm expecting the uh, one to be slightly quieter than the other. Uh, but to demo this, I'm just going to play some acoustic guitar, and then I'm going to bass the eye, just, just play some basic sort of rhythm or whatever on bass, whatever comes out. And um, yeah, then we listen back, I'll upload the files, you can make your own judgment. Um, and yeah, we go from there. So let's kick off with the Apogee Duet 2. Um, I'm using a Sontronics Apollo dual ribbon microphone, a very, very nice microphone indeed. It's about a thousand pounds worth of microphone. Um, it's lush sort of room ambience and kind of, uh, kind of thing. So uh, you're probably gonna hear some horrible reflections in this room as I'm not in my main recording room, but um, you know, might sound all right, who knows? So anyway, here goes. I'm going to try and aim the guitar directly at the mic for both um, takes so we're kind of square on to give it its most fair chance of sounding as similar as possible and if you hear any background noise it's the fan on the MacBook Pro sorry can't help that so here we go Okay, so there was a handful of chords on the Apogee Duet. Not a lot, I know. That's enough, I think, of my guitar playing. So now let's plug a bass in and hear some bass D high. Okay, so now we've got the RME Babyface, uh, inputs one and two, mic pre's one and two, they're set to 36, uh, 36 decibels of gain, they won't, it's either 34 or 36, so I went for 36. Uh, same mic placement, I haven't, well, I've tried to be exactly the same place, so I'm pointing the guitar as square onto the microphone as possible again. Uh, so let's hear how, how these sound, shall we?
There you go, sorry about the playing. Hopefully it's giving you an indication of what they sound like. Uh, so now I'm gonna plug the bass in, play the same uh, bass line, and um, yeah, let's see how that turns out. Okay, so there you go, some snippets of audio, bass DR and acoustic guitar. Sorry, it's not very good playing. Um, really struggling tonight. Anyway, hopefully it will give you some idea of the quality of both audio interfaces and the fact they probably sound pretty much the same. Um, again, the sound files will be up on SoundCloud. Download them, have a listen, make your own mind up. And um, yeah, I'll do a post sort of video going over how loud I found the interfaces and the differences that I find sort of in the door level wise when I've set both values to what should be the same so um, you know every setting is at the identical gain level so um, it'll be inter interesting to see what differences we have if you catch what I mean anyway that's all for now stick out catch you later bye